Baby, I'm the man. I'm, uh, uh, couple hundred bands in the car. Uh, Feeling in a mansion. Uh, uh, I'm then, I'm then. That's right. Even though he went that Instagram hooker, had a baby by him. <laughs> Cut by it her. out. Get out your feelings. He's still that nigga. Get out your feelings. I'm just saying. Gosh, I'm gonna get you're like a bitter woman. Like, come on, come on, man. Come I on. mean, that's supposed to be this. But it, like, the song supposed to be. That really it's was. supposed to be you, right? Yeah, exactly. I heard it all before, it's, child. Bye, girl. Okay, Bye. Sunshine Anderson. I'm just saying. <laughs> but in the building, we got Be Nice right there. OTP Records in the building. Time. What's up? What's up? What's up, some more? We out here. We working. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, you you from the West Coast to the Miami to like all over. You know what I mean? Tell us what's been going on with you. You dropped Be Nice one. We haven't heard from you since then. You got Be Nice three that's out there. Let us know what's going on with you. Now, last time you heard from you was Must Be Nice two. You know what I'm saying? It was a little over a year ago. You know, I had another uh, artist on the label that uh. That, you know i cut ties with so uh you know i came back strong with about three four more uh you know gentlemen that really got their uh they stuff together and uh you know i got must be nice three that just dropped out right now that's available on itunes all uh, right now we're really focusing on you know just that and uh tess soprano you know the youngest in charge what's that, what's that? The soprano there we go that's what i was waiting to hear soprano <laughs> yeah so he's dropping that problem child let him know what's going on when that drop Ted. drop talk it to me talk to gotta talk it to the mic that problem child drop it September 8th, man. Make sure y'all go get it, man. Finna flood the streets. Okay, okay. Well, I wish I had something from it to play. You know what I'm saying? But we will take care of that later. But give us some background on some of your musical influences and things like that. How you came you connected with OTP? I mean, uh, I'm from Alabama, you know. And uh, when I was, what, 16? You know, I used to get in trouble a lot. So I was in a uh, little group home or whatever. And I uh, linked up with me at a gas station in Atlanta. So then uh, he handed me the CD or whatever. I listened to it, you know, we liked it. And I hit him on Instagram. And I was like, you know, I got, I got something I want you to hear. Because I was thinking about quitting rapping, because it was like, you know, life wasn't going nowhere. So he told me he liked it. He wanted to sign me to the label. Uh, like, Hold on. Before I say that, he slept on me for about a week. <laughs> he ain't listening to nothing. He didn't play it, none of that. But about a week later, you know, he heard it. And he just signed me off that one song, you know, and we've just been working ever since. That's love. That's what it is right there. Tell me, you got any, you know what I'm saying, you want to? No, I'm just watching. You know vibes are a big thing with me, so they yes. vibe. You can tell that they gonna, they can, they cool with each other. Like, business is a big thing, and it's yeah. about vibes and stuff. You're supposed to just feel like, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? So that's cool. I wouldn't have known that they met at a gas station, though. Like, for him to say that and listen to their story, that's like, that's what's up. That's love. That's what it yeah. is right there. So Be Nice 3 is out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Nice three. That's out right now. That's on uh, iTunes. Uh, you know, you can catch it on Spotify. Uh, I think it's on that Dre, uh, that Dr. Dre yeah. beats. Uh, it's on. It's on a few little old spot. iTunes. Yeah. If, if you go check it out, must be nice three. You know, they can find it. Especially that iTunes. Definitely go support that that independent OTP records movement. You know. Uh, but back with the Tez thing, man. Yeah. It was just so beautiful when we met. Cause you know I, I was sleeping on. I'm not gonna front. I'm a real busy dude. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying. But uh, he kept on getting on me, and that's what you really got to do to get my mm -hmm. attention Be to persistent. slow me down. And that's what anybody that's really really busy doing things. You know, mm -hmm. you got to pull on their coat and let them know you really want it. Cause they ain't finna stop and just try to help everybody or be down with everybody to just say that they do something. You know what I mean? Yeah. But uh, I mean, he sent me the song. When I heard the song, I was blown away. And he was 16 at the time. From that one song, I was like, yeah, this kid is ahead of his time. You mm -hmm. know, he's definitely, definitely, you know, very, uh, you know, very um, important to the brand because he's the future of the label. You know, he's the youngest artist on the label. And uh, after that one song, once we started getting in the studio. And I started hearing more, and I was just like, wow, you know, this this, this dude, he, he really got it. So, so basically, you know, he probably going to be coming back, introducing the problem child when it drop. Oh, yeah, definitely, definitely. Okay. Well, must be nice, too. You know what I'm saying? That was in the past. Must be nice, three. That's what's out right now. What's what's the difference between that, you would say, before we spotlight this uh, track, uh, Pressure. I'm, I'm glad you asked. Uh, and pressure is a perfect example of the difference. Um, it must be nice too. I was kind of just giving the people a lot of different, um, a lot of different 
diversity in the music. You know what I mean? Um, it was a lot of street music. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, I gave them a, a little commercial track here and there. But on this Must Be Nice 3 project is when I had moved to Atlanta. So, I, you know, I got a little sauce and a lot of juice from a lot of people up there. Shout yeah. out to Zaytoven. Shout mm -hmm. out to Cheese Beats. Shout out to, you know, everybody that just showed me love in the A since I've been up there. You know, uh, co-CEO Chino Net Profit. You know, uh, he's up there in the A right now making a lot of things come together. He introduced me to a lot of people. And on this tape and what Chino brought to it as well, because he's all over the mixtape, he told me to have a little bit more fun fun you so, can tell you did that so you know i i got out of the seriousness of must be nice too of letting them know what it is that i'm doing and what's going on and i gave them more club friendly records and you were snapping on there too <laughs> just a that. little bit <laughs> like this record pressure how did this record come about because it's yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah. It, the, the the record pressure, man, it's actually the first record I ever, the first beat I ever bought from Zaytoven. Okay. And, uh, you know, when I heard it, it just spoke to me before I heard any words on it. And when I heard that beat, I was like, whoa, this is it right here. If there was no words, you would like this, this record just hearing the beat. Mm -hmm. So I knew, I told Zay, I need this right here. Mm -hmm. And it was the first one that I ran with. And, uh, you know, Chino and I hopped on there and, uh, you know, we made that thing happen. Yeah, 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 definitely. It definitely uh, put some pressure, make you, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you sit down, you got to stand up on this one. <laughs> I'm just that. saying, like, I appreciate that. You know how I go. You know what I mean? Look. And I'm going to try to contain <laughs> myself because I don't like doing my little dance when it's people in the building. Because y'all be laughing at me, look, because I don't dance. I play the records, okay? So we got more with Be Nice, Taz, Taz. Soprano. 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 Okay, you call him by his real name. Okay, you threw me for a minute. Soprano, be nice. OTP Records. Um, Pressure, go ahead and introduce it. We got more with you coming up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to introduce that Pressure produced by Zaytoven. Shout out to Chino Net Profit. That's me on that thing. Shout out to Atlanta, Miami. Everybody been showing love on top.